Apple Watch is a great product to have, but at times you may be done with it. You might be upgrading to a new one or you want to give it to somebody. And at this point, what you want to do is make sure you remove all your information from the Apple Watch so other people don't have it. Simple as that. In this video, I'm going to go through and show you exactly how to do that. I decided to give it to my wife because I no longer use it because I'm home all the time. So why not let her use it? So what we're going to do is show you how to go ahead and remove that. You can go ahead and give it to somebody else. Now this will remove all the data from the watch that is yours. So if you're trying to sell it, this would be perfect video for that to make sure whoever purchases it doesn't have any of your data. Welcome everybody. I'm Kevin with HelpfulTutorials.net. If you like iPhone tips, tricks, and tutorials, do me a favor, smack that subscribe button. We would love to have you join. And with that said, let's go ahead and dive in and talk more about this. Before we go through and show you how to unpair it on the phone, which is the preferred way, I do want to let you know how to do it on the watch, just in case you don't have your phone with you. That way you are still able to delete it. So what you would do on the watch itself is press the digital crown and then you would choose the settings app. Once in settings, you would choose general and then reset and reset all. And you probably have to enter your passcode that you have set up. That'll go through and delete the watch specifically, but if you have it paired with a phone and you have the phone, it's better to do it this way. So let me go ahead and show you exactly how to do that. So we're not gonna go in the settings app this time. We're gonna go in the watch app. So you wanna find the watch app and go ahead and select it. So now basically what we would wanna do is unpair the watch. If you're gonna go ahead and sell it or give it away, I would recommend to go through and update the Apple Watch first. You can do that just by going down to general here and going to software update and waiting to see if there's an update and then update it. I've already updated mine since I'm getting ready to do this. So with that, let's go ahead and unpair. So what you do is choose all watches at the top. There you'll see my watch. That's the one we wanna go ahead and remove. We'll hit the I, it'll bring it up here and you can find the Apple Watch or you can go ahead and unpair it. So what we're gonna do is unpair Apple Watch. And basically it's saying you will need to repair with the Apple Watch to use it again. Unpair, I'm gonna ask for your passcode, go ahead and put that in. Once you have that pasted in there, go ahead and choose unpair. And now it's gonna come up and take a moment to go through and unpair. So this is removing everything from the Apple Watch so it'll be able to set up completely from the beginning once this portion is done. So we'll give it a moment here. And on the Apple Watch, you should see like the Apple as soon as it's resetting. And then it'll come up and it'll look like it's brand new and you just go ahead and repair it. We'll give this a moment just to go through and unpair. I'll speed it up so you can see the very end. There we go. So now we have it all set up and it says good morning. If you have an Apple Watch, you can pair it with your iPhone here. So now I'm all set and the watch is ready to be given to my significant other and she can set it up exactly how she wants without having to worry if she has any of my data. Hope this helped. If you have any questions or any other video ideas, please leave them below and thank you so much for the view.